Hey kids, Inverted Cow here. Welcome back to Terra Tech. Let's get back into the game. Okay, we have flown over to um, one of the remaining hover training missions that we have here. Um, I don't think I can get Hubby here to redo his spiel. But he, of course, just wants me to basically buy, if I can click on him, there we go. Sure, why not, let's buy another hoverbird. Where's my hoverbird? Right there. All right, you just hold a, hold your jets there, dude. Pack that one away. Okay, let's see if we can do these hover mission trial again. We know how much we love hover craft. Right. See, I tried to play this using the Xbox controller. Um, uh, it wants me to press shift to go up and down, right? It's not helping. All right. Uh, controls, please. Dude, I'm not liking your hovercraft. Just so you know, I don't like your hovercraft. I don't like the way they handle. Like the way I can't handle them. Okay, hovercraft. Roll strafe is that. Lift is up and down arrow. Propellers are shift. I don't have propellers. Okay, so up and down arrow. Oh, okay, up arrow gives me a little jump. Yay, that is awesome. You did it, hooray, yippee. <laughs> Can I contain my enthusiasm a little bit more? junk. And then we're going to save that. Low tech. We're going to go back to hopeless flight. 
because at least that one I can fly. Keep forgetting I made some modifications to this so it flew I a little bit better and then I forget that I never saved them. <laughs> and then I gotta remake those modifications again and I never remember to do it. There we go, that's that. So we're going to pack you away. We're not mining the rhodite ore. But we will attempt one more time the anti-gravity racetrack. So we're going to start heading over towards that. Find a target for it here. Come on, you can lift off. There you go. Target's over that way somewhere. Hi, Hubble. Alright, let's purchase your anti-gravity thing. Yes, please. It's a hundred thousand dollar craft. Cool. And we'll just pack that away. And we will snapshot so we know what that looks like in case we get blown up. Cool. Well, she spins nice. like it is again mostly all oh, can we go forward please <laughs> is there any ability to go forward hello forward no here okay this is seriously impossible to fly wow this thing is <laughs> Yeah, real. good thing there's no timer because there's no way I'm doing this in any sort of degree of time. It's like trying to fly a balloon. Okay, let's see if we can get... problem with this is as it spins randomly on its own 
your controls to move around and I've got no direction as to which end is forward so I basically have to randomly keep pulsing controls until I find the one that gets it to float in the direction I want it to. Forward. No, that's not forward. Can we go... Reverse, 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 down, 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 straight, left, 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 up. Okay, reverse, no, forward. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> Hard enough to control as it is. Okay, right, 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 left, 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 right, 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 left, left, left. Reverse. Not forward. No. Down, 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 down. Quit. I need four hands. One to control the camera, two to control the ship, one to control the pitch. Tempted to fly yet. I can say wow okay cool um, I might figure out how these anti-gravity engines work and see if I can incorporate them into the city a little bit more um, but yeah wow that was absolute crap That was absolute crap. Well, at least that one is finally off my list. Um, I don't think I'm ever going to try to fly an anti-grav tech like that again with no direction forward and no stabilization whatsoever. It was almost impossible. So let's grab this. Let's go find a new... Um, trade thing.
shooting at me. Go shoot at somebody else's. Anti-gravity time trial. Yeah, no, not no, mm, no, not even gonna bother. That was too much of a pain to do that track. Um, the, these hover vehicles are just too difficult. Uh, everything else I got is just garbage missions. Yeah, I, I'm not, there's no way. Those, if that's an indication of what I'm seeing with these anti-grav tracks, the frustration level on them would be just far too much more than it's worth. Um, can you just give me buildable ones only, please? Show available text only, please. Thank you. I don't even have one of my tanks available. That's funny. Okay, well, um, I think that's gonna pretty much do it for this game. Um, I'm pretty much maxed on everything except for a little bit more of the future tech. I, I'm just, I'm not impressed with these future tech missions. Um, I don't like what I'm seeing and this is a fun little game. You can just pick it up and get back to it, but um, I'm thinking it might be time to change what I'm doing in this slot. Uh, go back and play a different uh, game here. I'm having a lot of fun with Scrap Mechanic, but the grind on Scrap Mechanic is ridiculously hard. Um... And, yeah, I'm not seeing much left in the campaign missions on this that's of uh, any real interest to me. Uh, I'm not too happy with the way the build is coming out on this. The main, the base build that I was trying on, I might pick that up again later or try it again with the, uh, play around with the anti-gravity tech a little bit more. Controls on this game overall leave a lot to be desired. Um, you can't assign control keys to a controller like a. So I I play primarily with a, a 360 controller, and I find that you can't con assign certain controls to it. And I, there's things I'd really like to assign. Uh, the game has a lot of potential, and. It, it is a lot of fun. I mean, it's a fun little build. Just go out and build stuff to blow crap up kind of thing. Um, what can I say? I still like the, the jamming guitar tunes. Um, and the soft, mellow music you get when you're cruising around. Overall, I would like to say this is a... This is a game I'd probably say buy it on sale. Uh, and if you have friends that you can play it with or you like to get into competitions with people on it or something, that might be fine. I mean, that might be what you're into. Um, but for me, I think this is going to be the last episode of Terra Tech, uh, mainly because it's... I'm at the point where I'm not seeing anything else that's of, of interest to me. Um, and I don't like to get into games 
once the game loses interest in it, I, uh, I tend to shelve it. Uh, I do have a lot in my inventory that I just haven't been playing. Um, I know Raft has been toying with uh, putting out a new update, but they haven't gotten around to it. Yeah, it's all the same missions, all all the same stuff. Okay. Um, I was kind of hoping that they would have dropped that update by now, but they haven't. And... Um, yeah, I think that's going to do it. I'm not sure what I'm going to put in this in this time slot for a while, but... Uh, thanks all for watching, kids. Hope you enjoyed Terra Tech, and... Yeah, hope you stick around for whatever else is coming up on the channel. Currently, right now, I am playing uh, Autonauts, Space Haven, and Scrap Mechanic. And if there's anything you think I'd like to try out, go ahead and suggest it. Um, we are running a budget gaming, so I mean, I can't go and buy every brand new game that's out there, which is as much as I'd like to. So, thanks all for watching. And good night for now.